gentlemen, this is nothing new to you. Modern mechanical engineering has always been right at home here at Duo. But today, I get to show you something you have most likely not yet experienced. We are now in Duo's so-called digital factory. And as the name already gives away, this is the place where Duo is driving digital change with the help of all new solutions. And to find out even more, I now look forward to Gerhard Alonso Garcia. Hi, Gerhard. Hello, Jasmine. Nice to see you. Thank you. Now, Gerhard, you have been developing software for robots for some years now. What has changed these past few years and what's different today? Yes, uh, we developed machine-oriented software for automation tasks. With the DXQ products, we develop now intelligent applications, many based on artificial intelligence algorithms to increase the OEE, the overall equipment efficiency, for individual machines or the entire plant. As our customers increasingly install the software products on clouds or servers, we have to consider IT rules and thus we have to be very similar to an IT company. Which you are with the digital factory. Why does this require a digital factory in the first place? In the digital factory, we pool valuable resources from our business units. As we harmonized our activities across the business units, we developed a software toolkit that business units uh, can benefit from. Closing up for our better understanding, could you explain to us how the digital factory is structured in terms of your employees? In the digital factory, we work with 20 agile teams. Each team is consisting of five to seven team members. The coding takes place at Nearshore Partners in Europe. To make this work well, we installed in the first floor communication equipment and suitable rooms. The teams work in sprints. Each sprint takes exactly three weeks. After three weeks, we organize a review meeting where the teams present to the stakeholders the result of the, of the sprint and they also uh, present their efficiency. The biggest asset of the DU company or the DU group is the domain know-how in our applications and algorithms. We work in interdisciplinary teams with experts from the machinery and plant design, with process specialists and with construction site teams. And we involve in a very uh, early stage our customers. Mm, wonderful. Thank you for these insights and I hope to see you again soon. Thank you very much. You're welcome. And ladies and gentlemen, it's now time for us to check out the atmosphere in which all of this work actually takes place. Extremely interesting place, Duo's digital factory, and we're about to learn even more about it from the person in charge of the business development and pre-sales digital solutions department, Dr. Annabel Linzel. This is the person who makes sure that here everything is produced and developed to cover all of the customer's needs. Hello, Annabelle. Hello, Yasmin. Now, Annabelle, I just gave you a very short mini introduction. Maybe you could use a specific example to explain to us what exactly is being developed here at the Digital Factory. Sure. So we are, for example, developing a product called DXQ Equipment Analytics. Um, that's developed in two of our Agile teams, one focusing more on application technology and the other team focusing on our process and conveyor technology. So the product itself aims at improving the overall equipment effectiveness and it does so by using um, technology of artificial intelligence so that we can analyze big data. So with the help of the big data we can for example identify um, yeah, wear models of certain components um, so that we can trigger condition-based maintenance tasks or we can, um, on the other hand, identify anomalies in process data so that we can predict the production quality later on. That does sound exciting. When was this software brought to market and how have your customers been reacting towards it so far? So it's quite new actually. It has been launched in the second quarter of 2020. Um, and the customer feedback is quite good so far. So they said the software helps them to ensure inline quality 
and also help them to plan maintenance windows individually and also to prevent downtimes. So for example, one customer said that um, they could successfully identify worn out and also defective components such as paint pressure regulators when using the software. So based on our estimations, when used correctly, the software can help um, to, to create savings in, per year in a five to six digit number at a particular process station. Wow, that's impressive and I'm sure the customers are glad to hear that. Thank you for this insight, Annabelle. Thank you. gentlemen, there you have it. Products are already being developed today to meet tomorrow's requirements right here in the digital factory.